Binary numbers are the basis of all computer systems. They're the smallest unit of data. Here we'll learn how to count and do simple conversions to and from binary. It'd be quite useful if you have a pen and paper and a calculator for this chapter. Computers only understand ones and zeros, so all data, no matter what it is, must be converted to binary. Numbers and letters can easily be converted but even pictures are read as ones and zeros. In your exam, you will be asked to convert binary to deanery and vice versa. So you need to know that deanery is what you know as normal numbers. It has Latin origins for the number 10. Deanery is also known as base 10. Binary is known as base two. So you can see where the where we're going with this one. Binary has two options, one or zero, so base two. Deanery has ten options, so base ten. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Here is a basic counting table to show examples of deanery to binary and vice versa. You'll notice that they have different sizes, with some being one bit and some being a nibble. I actually find it easier thinking in bytes and it makes it easier when you're doing conversions. So you can add however many zeros in front of the binary string to make it eight digits. So I've filled in a table to show you an example of what I mean here. In your exam, you'll need to be able to convert binary into deanery and back again. Here's an easy way how to do it. First, You'll need to practice remembering drawing what we call a conversion table. It's really easy. Okay. You can either start by putting 128 on the left hand side of your page and halving it each time until you get down to the number one. Or if you like, you can put a one on the right hand side and keep doubling it until you reach 128. Put it into a little table with lines in between like you can see at the top of this slide. You'll notice as well that you have 8 columns because 8 bits make 1 byte. Go ahead and draw this table on a piece of paper now. Here we can do a worked example and you can do this yourself. You can write in the number 01010110 into your table. Using your calculator for now until you get used to the process. Add up the numbers wherever there's a number 1 in your table. For example, there's a number 1 underneath 64 and 1 underneath 16. So, you would add up 64 to 16. You carry on doing this for all of the others where there's a 1. For this particular example, it would be 64 plus 16 plus 4 plus 2. This comes to 86. So the binary number 01010110 is 86 in deanery. Have a go at these ones yourself. Remember, write in the number into your table. Add up all of the numbers where there's a 1. Hopefully, you got these answers. If you didn't, just try them again. Go back to the previous slide and just have another little go. Okay, so in the exam you might be asked to convert from deanery to binary. You can still use your conversion table, so you might want to draw another one to practice with now. The basic principle is actually quite easy. You start with your number and put a 1 in the box for the biggest number that will go into that number. Then you subtract this from your number and repeat the same steps. When you finished, you'd put a zero in all the remaining empty boxes. So let's try a little example. If we take the deanery number 93 and try to convert it into binary, if you look at this slide, I've done the whole example and worked it through. So number one, the biggest number that goes into 93 in the table is 64. So you put a one in the table underneath 64. Then we subtract 64 from 93 and you get left with 29. So we repeat that same step. The 
biggest number that goes into 29 is 16. So you put a 1 under 16 and subtract it from your 29. You get left with 13. So you see what the biggest number that goes into 13 is, which is 8. You put a number 1 underneath 8 and subtract it from 13. You get left with 5. See what the biggest number that goes into 5 is, is 4. So you put a number 1 underneath 4. Subtract 4 from 5 and you're left with 1. Biggest number that goes into 1 is 1. So you put a number 1 underneath the 1. Subtract 1 from 1 and you get 0. Now you put a 0 in all of the empty boxes. So the number 93 in deanery, um, when you convert to the binary, is 0, 1, 0, 1. 1101. Have a go at these ones yourself. Remember, put a number 1 in the biggest number that will go into your number and then subtract it and repeat the steps. When you're finished, put a 0 in all of the empty boxes. I filled in the complete table with all of the answers of those conversions. Hopefully these are the ones that you got. Again, if you didn't, just go back and have another go. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful. Please like and subscribe. Bye.